Hey guys, welcome or welcome back. I am so happy to be finally back on YouTube after giving birth to my beautiful baby girl about seven weeks ago now. And I thought what better video to come back with than sharing with you my little Hermes baby haul, the items that we got for our little baby girl. And I finally decided on and bought a nappy bag or a diaper bag. So I wanted to show you which nappy bag I ended up getting because I've been getting a few questions about that since before I gave birth. So yeah, I am so happy to be back. Thank you guys for sticking around while I was away. Motherhood is definitely challenging. I am very sleep deprived, but luckily we have a lot of support. My mom is currently looking after baby C, so I have this opportunity and time to film this video. So yes, we are really grateful. Anyway, without further ado, let's get started with the baby items that we bought from Hermes. So as you can see from the thumbnail, we bought a few items for baby C from Hermes before she was born, but I just never got the chance to share these items with you before but I thought better late than never so I'm gonna start with the smallest item this one actually came all the way from Paris we could not find this item anywhere in Australia but we absolutely loved this one if you guys watched my Paris special order Birkin unboxing you guys know that hubby went all the way to Paris to pick up that bag a couple of months ago and while he was there he was able to find this item that we really wanted so let's open this up this is the cutest thing ever. And ta-da! How cute. These are little Mary Jane shoes for baby C. I believe these came in several different colors, but we wanted something really, really neutral. Obviously, this size seems to be a little bit too big for a newborn baby, so I know she won't be wearing these for a little while still, but what really sold us on these shoes are, wait for it, Oh, the soles, how cute are the soles? Can you see those horsies? They are just so, so cute. So I believe that baby C won't be really walking in them because looking at the size of them, she'll be wearing them around six months. By the way, she's a big baby and she's gaining weight really well. So she's already quite a chubber, but we thought when she wears them, she's probably gonna be lying down and have her feet like this. So the soles will always be showing and we thought how cute. It's got a little snap button as well. And inside of the shoe, it says Hermes with that little horsey again. So yeah, we're really excited that this came all the way from Paris. Uh, by the way, the shoes were, I believe, 195 euros. So a hefty, hefty price tag for a pair of baby shoes, but with a splurging on one cute pair that she can possibly keep forever as little keepsake was worth it. Next up, we have a slightly larger item. I think this will be a pretty useful item for on the go or at home as well. So let's open this up and show you what's in this medium sized box. I feel so rusty filming a video at the moment because it's been so long since I filmed last time. The last video you guys saw was probably three or four weeks ago, but those videos were pre-filmed before I gave birth. So I haven't filmed for over two months now. So I feel super, super rusty. So bear with me. Um, anyway, here we are. We have a thin blanket. I'll insert the name of this. I just cannot remember any of these names. These were bought before the baby was born. So it's been a while. And also I've got baby brain. I forget everything these days. It's just crazy. It is a lightweight blanket. It's got the little horsies. It is a pretty good size. I'll also insert the sizing on screen as well. So this is the cute little baby blanket we got. It is in 100% cotton. Cotton is great for babies. It feels really soft. I especially love the colorway, how it's really neutral. We've got the soft gray and I love how they match the little soft yellow and the pictures are just really, really lovely. So we thought this will be a really great item to just use at home as a little lightweight blanket as well as on the go, you can have this as an extra layer to put on the baby in the pre Pram. because it is so lightweight it will be so easy to carry around with us even on the go so that is the second item we got for baby C and the last item is in this box here so let's get into this box this was the last item that we bought so these three items were all bought on separate occasions <gasps> Ta-da! it is another blanket so it is in the same material as 
our favorite blanket that we use in our lounge room, which is the Avalon blanket. It is really warm and Baby C is a winter baby. So we thought it would be really nice to have something really warm and cozy for her cot and for her room in general. It'll be a really nice piece to have just hanging anywhere in her little room. So again, the color theme is basically the same as the smaller blanket. This one also has the gray, the yellow. I love this yellow and the cream. I love the orange accents. It just adds a little bit of vibrance to this whole color palette. And this one is a little bit larger, so we won't be using this for on the go, but I thought that was a really nice item for the nursery. And you can see it says Hermes there, but it is really subtle. The Avalon blankets also come in the baby sizes, which is this size as well, but it's got the big H's and I didn't really want a logo-y piece for the baby or the nursery because I just didn't think that that looked really nice. But this one is really subtle, but overall it's just a really cute blanket. This one is in the same composition as your Avalon blankets. So this one is 90% wool and 10% cashmere, which makes the material quite soft. I actually really like the baby blankets from Hermes. I don't think you necessarily have to use these blankets for the baby, but if you're looking for a smaller blanket than the Avalon blanket, then this one is a great option. And these baby blankets are a little bit cheaper than the Avalon blanket as well. So if you want something slightly smaller, that is just as nice, this is a really great option for even adults. So they're the little items that we bought from Hermes for baby C. Obviously these are not cheap by any means, but we thought because these are sort of general items that we can use for years to come we thought they were really worth it minus the shoes which were just going to be keepsakes but rather than splurging on clothes or anything that babies grow out of really quickly that would be such a waste of money these blankets can last for a much much longer so the cost per wear will be much better on these so that's basically how we justify the price tags on these items and finally let me share with you the nappy bag that i went with i've already been using it and i've been loving it it is this new parent backpack from lululemon i thought about going a designer bag for a nappy bag but i just didn't find anything that was really that suitable I almost had a cute tote bag, but that was like $3,000 for a canvas bag and I really couldn't justify it. A lot of people use things like Dior Book Tote or even a Chanel DeVille Tote, but at the end of the day, I thought I just want something really practical, functional that I don't have to really baby. So Hubby actually came across this bag on Instagram. Lululemon had an ad of this bag. I believe it's a newer style and you guys may know that I absolutely love Lululemon yoga gear. It is one of my favorite brands to shop from. So when we saw this, we thought this was a really great idea. It is completely wipeable. It is a backpack style and it's unisex. So hubby can wear it without feeling feminine at all because some of the nappy bags look really odd when guys wear it, in my opinion. It's got great compartments. So it's got a front pocket. It's got another pocket here where we keep some gauze wipes. The back just looks like this. It's got little clips so you can hang this bag on your pram as well. So we thought that was really clever. And when you open it up, interior is all wipeable as well. It's got some compartments. So we've got some nappies and some wipes there at the moment and some disposable change mats. And an extra singlet in there. That's basically what it looks like. And it also has two drink bottle holders on the outside, which will be great for either your drink bottle or baby's drink bottle. And it also comes with an extra crossbody bag, which I don't think I'll really wear, but inside of it, there is actually a wipeable change mat for on the go. So if you're just out and about, you can use this as a change mat as well. The price tag on this Lululemon nappy bag was $219, which is on the pricier side for Lululemon bags. But I generally really like their quality. It is very functional. And compared to some of the designer bags that I could have really gone for, this price, I really didn't mind. So that is what I ended up picking up as my nappy bag. And that's basically everything that I wanted to share with you today. It was a great way for me to ease back into filming. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you are a new parent as well, which I know some of you are because some of you kindly reached out to me telling me that you've just had a baby as well. Hopefully you found these items entertaining to watch. If you have any questions about these items, do leave them in the comments below. I intend to get back into filming for regular content again as of today. So hopefully I can get out videos at least somewhat regularly. 
It feels really nice to be doing the normal things that I used to do. Obviously, I'm not back at work yet. It's just too soon. It hasn't even been two months, but being able to film my YouTube video is really making me feel like my old self. I love spending time with my baby, but at times it just feels like I am just not myself and I'm doing the same repetitive things like feeding, burping, changing, putting the baby to sleep multiple times throughout the day, every single day, day in, day out. And I really needed to do something for myself. So I am so happy to be filming again. Anyways, as always, thank you so much for watching and spending some of your precious time with me today. Thank you so much for letting me share in my joy. And I cannot wait to see you guys again soon in my next video. Bye guys.